Okay, this is uh, the G40 out of box. This is going to be uh, UK turn number three. And this turn is going to be done a little bit differently because I took the turn, tried to upload the video, and for some reason the video said it was corrupted or it wouldn't go. So I'm just going to recap what happened. I, I did give the choice to the Axis first to either keep it or not keep it. Um, they said just go ahead and recap what happened. And uh, so thanks guys for trusted me to get this uh, done here. So just to, to recap, um, so there were, uh, for the purchases, um, the UK Far East uh, purchased for 13 IPCs, a fighter and an infantry um, that went into India. Uh, so that was, um, so there were two IPCs saved because they had 15 to start. Um, and the only the only thing they really did was they tried to take the one infantry from Shan State to Malaya and uh, and just take out that uh, took a long shot at that artillery. They lost in the second round, and so it's dead. Uh, they also moved the infantry from Siam to Shan State. Uh, they moved some units forward, and they moved their fighter over to Persia. Uh, so. Let's talk about this side. So the purchases on this side, spending all of their IPCs, was a tank, a mech infantry, and a transport for down here in South Africa, and a minor industrial complex uh, for Persia. So what they did, just two battles, uh, they walked into Kenya with one infantry, and then they took the bomber from Belgian Congo and came all the way up to Iraq, they raided Iraq with their three infantry and the bomber. They got two hits on the first round, and so I took a tactical bomber and an artillery for the Italians and took two infantry for uh, the British, and then I retreated back to Persia, um, landing the bomber there, and then, of course, that's the fighter from India that flew over. Now, I guess I, mean, I, didn't, I didn't ask Baran what units he wanted to have taken. I assume it would be those two. Uh, however, if he had not taken the Italian artillery, I would have pressed the attack. Um, but uh, given the two hits in the first round, I just went ahead and kept my one infantry and moved back. So um, those were the, the the death there. Now, if you want, so if you want to do something different, Baron, just just let me know. Um, but that's what I did for uh, for those attacks. So. Um, that's a, about it. There were a couple of movements. We moved everything back from Egypt into Sudan and one infantry up from the Belgian Congo there as well. Uh, the interesting move was uh, the, my three aircraft that were in Morocco. Instead of heading back to England, they booked it around and came over to French Central Africa. And uh, that is uh, pretty much it. They didn't really do much else. Um, I'll, I'll still do a recap here at the end. Uh, so then the Far East Command, they collected uh, eight IPCs because they didn't change. They started at eight. They collected eight. I'll just show it there. And, I'll, and then the, uh, the, the UK, they moved up from 30 to 31 when they took, took back uh, Ethiopia. And, uh, um, but the, uh, the Far East Command, they collected eight, but they banked two, so they have 10 IPCs for the next round. Uh, the UK, they have 10, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4. And I'll tell you why, because they collected their 31, but then they got convoyed terribly. Uh, we rolled double, the double ones in 106. And then a 2 and a 3 in 109. So it took off 7 IPCs. That's why they're down to only 24 remaining. That piece was brutal. Um, and that's it. So, yes, and I, I went through what the combats were, the non-combats, and the IPC collection. So let's just do a quick recap of where everything is, and then call it good. So in Quebec, we have 2 infantry and artillery and a tank. In the UK, we have... Um, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 infantry, 5 AA, 2 fighters, and a mech infantry. 
In Malta, we have an infantry and an, an anti-aircraft gun. In French Central Africa, we have two fighters and attack. In Anglo-Egyptian Sudan, we have two uh, artillery and three infantry. In South Africa, we have a tank and a mech infantry. In Season 71, we have a transport. In Persia, we have a new in, in, uh, minor complex, an infantry, a fighter, and a, a strategic bomber. In India, we have four infantry, an AA, and a fighter. And then in Burma, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine infantry, two AAs, three artillery, and then the the uh, um, the, the flying tigers are there as well. And in Shan State, we have one infantry. Okay, that's it. So where everything is. Sorry about the problem with the video, but uh, at least now you know uh, what happened. So I mean, I had a decent roll here. I had, you know, it didn't work out over here, and that stuff up there was just terrible. This has been a not a very great game for the uh, the UK in their rolling. So, all right, that's it. Uh, on to next to the Italians with Baron. Good luck.